it was a horror uh, kind of uh, event that I wouldn't want any human being to go through. Uh, what happened is that we were taken by unknown men when the flight was about to take off and we were taken into the domestic uh, terminal in a space uh, which looks like a, a chamber, a torture chamber of some sort where uh, the four of us had to go through uh, various interrogation uh, through torture uh, by these unknown uh, uh, state agencies uh, per se. So um, they used their uh, feet, they used their bare hands, they used um, metal bars uh, to beat us during that particular process whilst they are interrogating us on uh, whether uh, we are planning for a demonstration, who are planning for demonstration, uh, what kind of meeting are you going to have in Victoria Falls. And I think uh, the activities and actions on the day were driven by paranoia by the state, which I think uh, is because of um, legitimate crisis emanating from the 2023 election that these uh, comrades of ours who are driving the Harare administration, they don't believe that uh, they have got uh, the backing of the support of the people. And I think that makes them uh, enter into this kind of paranoia where they are, are trying to uh, suffocate uh, the voice of citizens, especially uh, those that are deemed uh, aligned to the opposition.